Anyway, welcome to Bomb Bros Play Banjo Kazooie. Bomb Bros debut. I am Bomb Brother Wesley, and this. I'm Jacob. Is Bomb Brother Jacob. He's not getting into it, but okay. I'm Jacob. Let's do this. Oh, what was I gonna say? Um. Oh, yeah, this is our debut. This is our first video. This is it. So, welcome to the channel. Unless this is a year later, then, you know, the next year I say welcome back. Yeah. After you've watched tons of our other playlists, such as yeah. Insert Future Game Here. Yeah. Or everybody's favorite classic of... Everyone knows this game. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> oh, man, we love that one. Yeah. Oh, who's this? This would be good. Ding pot, ding pot, by the bench, who is the nicest looking wench? <laughs> gloop, 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 it's good hey. any day. She really makes my, makes my breath away. <coughs> Yes, you're right. Looks stand me out from the crowd. <laughs> you're darn tootin', you're green. Yeah. With a purple scarf and some yeah. red lining. Red lining for the uh, inside of it. But there's this girl. What do you mean? This cannot be. There's no one prettier than me. Why, it's Tootie, young small young and small. She's the prettiest girl of all. <laughs> no, no, no! You must be mad. Nicer beauty can't be had. You know, she does kind of have a point. I think you'll find it's Tootie. She's cute and kind. I think she has a point, though. I mean, when you think about it, the valley she lives in is inhabited by herself, two bears, a bird, and a mole. So, yeah. Yeah, I mean, that's, that's pretty much, uh, that's it. That should say something whenever a bear is pretty Look at that. Why would you live there with that right outside your front door? I know, right? You walk outside, and, oh, there's the witch's face on the side of the mountain, you know? And just... it, but it has to be a really cheap location to live in. Yeah, I know, right? And then apparently they got a rodent problem. There's a mole. Oh, God, he's got stupid glasses. <laughs> nah, we love bottles. Bottles is awesome. I'm going to be bottles for Halloween. Not really. You're not shaped like that at all, Jacob. I'm going to get there. Okay, I can be anything I want to be. All right, including a raging fado, fat ass. Fado, that's right, fado. That's what I get for trying to censor myself. Log from Blamo. <laughs> I mean, this is kind of nuts, though. I mean, seriously. Well, look at it. Yeah. What do you mean nuts? Look at the sky. Instantly, just changes. It's like Death Mountain. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I love. I the... mean, Hyrule is one thing, but this is a fantasy world. This is Spiral Mountain we're talking about here. Sure, I don't know all the names. Sorry. Yeah, I do. I was drinking water. Yeah, we're choosing this game to be the first for me in particular to be playing, because I have been playing this game since it came out in 1998. And for those of you, just in case you haven't noticed, I'm going to go ahead and say it: I am playing this on my Xbox 360. Because we don't have a working Nintendo 64, and I don't want to emulate. Oh, snap. Roast us. Yeah. <laughs> We're not purists. Roast me. <laughs> but anyway, I have played this game almost once a year, every year, since it came out in 1998. You know, I read somewhere that, that this is the game of the year, every year, all year. For all years, every year. All of them, yes. <laughs> what, oh, what year was it game of the year? All of them. Exactly. All right, let's do this. Oh, I'm Bottles, the short-sighted mole. Could you imagine if people in real life just spoke gibberish sounds like that, but we completely understood each other the entire time? That is what we do. In a manner Think about languages. Yes. That's Think true. Think about somebody in Africa or somebody in... Europe speaking like German or something. We don't Germans? know. What, yeah. No, I mean, we don't know what they're saying. It, it, it it's sounds all just, like complete, it's all noises. That's all we do is sounds, slap our tongue around our mouth and click our teeth together and we make words. Yep. Very articulated words, like colloquial. Yes. Indubitably. Which, which, colloquial, by the way, is a very fancy way of saying informal, basically. I think I just said basically like three times in one sentence, so forgive the redundancy. 
of the wording of that sentence. Anyway, I wasn't paying attention, but you're going to decline the training, right? Yes, of course. You, you, actually, you probably need to watch this. Do I? Probably. It's not like we just played this part last night. In a very failed. failed attempt to record, by the way. So our, our shot at YouTubing is off to a god-awful start, but I'm going to decline it anyway. 40-minute video, and then a 9-minute, 55-second video after. Gone. Forgot, forgot to turn the switch for the commentary button on the on our capture software. So yeah, we had just... Microphone was on and everything, a little light. It was great. We were all happy, having a good time. I'm going to hurry up, run around, because it's basically a free upgrade to your life if you get the six empty honeycomb pieces. Extra honeycomb. No, would that be an onion? That was an onion, yes. And that would have been health. Yeah, but I don't need it. That's a carrot. Carrots are very healthy. <laughs> Look at the messaging in this. Attack your vegetables. That's what I do. Eat healthy. Murder your food with your teeth. Meat is murder. Sweet and delicious murder. <laughs> <laughs> An extra life. It's a trophy. A Banjo Kazooie, and he flexes when he talks. <laughs> hey. Don't you wish you uh, had a tro a golden trophy of yourself in your front yard front room? I know I do. I I don't. For so, <laughs> so I, I know we just literally played this last night, but there, are there six pieces in this? Yes, valley? there is. There are. There are. Yes. There is six pieces, or there are six pieces. There are six pieces. Sorry. Forgive us. We're we hail from the great state of Tennessee, so our choices in diction are not always the most intelligent sounding. Diction. But I swear, we do know what we're talking about, and I pray you can kind of figure it out. Hard in our vernacular. I'll have my moments where I can sound smart like that, and then I'll have my other moments where I sound like a complete idiot. So, one more to go, and that would be up here. This flying cauliflower has it. Oh man, I noticed that it burst into florets. Look at them. They look so disgusting. Comment down below if you hate cauliflower like me. Or if you like cauliflower like me. <laughs> Aren't we silly? <laughs> Poll of the day. Do you like cauliflower? Yeah, that's our question of the day. Do you like cauliflower? <laughs> Strap in. It's going to be a wild ride, guys. <laughs> yeah, can you tell? <laughs> now, pay attention to this. The sudden change in the landscape. You can hear the squelching of his feet. Crazy. Oh, that's so gross. Then the... <laughs> Ready to tackle the witch now. <clears throat> sure are. Show us the way. You mean the one way right there, how the do, only how do bridge? We get, how do we get there? I see I see the mountain, but it's like, I don't understand. It's like, I, I'm looking at this, but how do I... Wait a second. And I have fully functioning legs. I wonder. Oh my god, it worked. This is awesome! This is great! Into Grunty's lair we go. Aw, poor Tootie. Fun little fact for you, that's one of our dog's names. Well, my grandmother's dogs. Jacob, you're having far too much fun with this uh, nonsensical it's of, gibberish. It's, it's, it is what it is, okay? I'm not saying it's a bad thing, I'm just pointing out the fact that you're having a lot of fun with this. Yeah, it's Banjo-Kazooie, dude. This is, this is us as children. This, it really this was. This is what we did as children. Yes, 18 years ago, this game came out. And that should be a testament to the fact that this game is nearly 20 years old and it aged really well. It was so much fun and people still to this day herald it as one of the best games ever. And by people we mean us. No, there are people that do agree with us there. And now we venture Grunty's Lair. <laughs> Next time on Bomb Bros, watch us get into the first world and explore more good stuff of the greatest game ever made. The first episode's already over? It's over! What did we do? We did the intro video, I skipped the tutorial, I got an extra life piece for my health bar, and gave everyone the intro, like I said. Stick around, did, folks. Did you remember that we gave, we did the intro? Yes, I did. Oh. Forgive us, folks. We're idiots. We're here to have fun. We hope you have fun with us as well. 
Stick around, thank you. It's gonna be a crazy ride, guys. Like I said, buckle up. Question of the day. Do you like cauliflower? Yes or no? Peace out, bombros.